So if you haven't guessed by the title of the video, we're going to be talking about the Discraft Athena today. That being said, I've got six discs in my hand, only two of which are Athenas. That's these two. I've got two Stalkers. And I've also got two FDs. The FD is what I've been bagging for the last couple of weeks. I like it a lot, but I've had these Athenas, haven't really had a chance to throw them a whole lot. So I'm gonna give those a head to head against the FD as well as the Stalker, which is what I replaced with the FD recently. The FD is a little bit more stable than the Stalker. The ESP plastic tends to beat in pretty quick for me. So I like this C-Line a lot. But that being said, I like the way the Athena feels in the hand. Uh, it's, it's a little bit shallower, I think, and the stalkers tend to have a little bit of a bead to them. So i uh, curious to see how I like it and how it throws. But out here at Westminster Park in Rock Hill, South Carolina, at probably one of the coolest things I've seen on the disc golf course in a while, and that's a driving range. So if you look over my uh, left shoulder here, you can see there are some rocks in the field. There's also a basket. That basket's at 100 feet and the rocks are at two, three, four, and on 100 feet. My goal with all six of these is I wanna throw them flat and see how they finish, also how they hold. There's a little bit of a swirling wind, so this might be kind of indecisive, but looking at some of the flags around, it looks to be mostly a tail, maybe a little bit of a uh, left to right tail, but let's give these a whirl. So the stalkers next. Just as a note of transparency, one of these stalkers, one of the Athenas and one of the FDs are pretty much brand new. Uh, one of these stalkers was the one that I threw before the FDs. One of the FDs is my current in my current bag. And then one of these Athenas is a little bit used when I first got it just to throw it a little bit, but I would say it's more or less brand new, so yeah. The FD, Athena, and Stalker, all really consistent. It was kind of weird. All three of these shot shapes were all within about 10, 15 feet of each other, maybe. So that was kind of cool. They all flew very similar. Uh, that's also neat because what that does is it gives you some choice as far as hand feel, what feels good, uh, colors. But anyway, they essentially flew very similarly. So please leave a comment down below if there's something you throw in this slot that's different than these three. I'd love to know about it. Maybe give it a shot, see how it compares. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share the video. 